everyone, I'm Nikki Martinez from KVME and KGLY in Tyler, Texas, and I was asked to share two of the things that I learned at CMB Summit 2016 Nashville, um, and there was a lot to take in, I will say that. I'm thankfully a note taker, so I'm able to go and process it a few days afterwards, but it was some great information. One of the things I learned on the music programming side of things, so on Thursday, um, was how consumption really can uh, make a difference in how you select some of the songs that you select as a music director, as a music programmer. Um, I definitely take into consideration the art of it all. I love music. I've always loved music since I was little, super, super little. But it's always good to also have extra science behind it and numbers behind it. And they said that actually for every 150 times a song is streamed, that can equal to one a digital download and it's interesting to kind of see you can actually find some of that information through billboard on their website um, you can see the digital consumption or the digital streaming so the numbers of stream per song or you can also also ask your record label rep um, and get some of that information which especially if you're having to kind of break a tie and figure between two songs which one you want to add it can help a little bit I would I would totally see that so that's something that I want to take into account the next time that I'm picking my music or at least really consider it for sure and then the second thing I learned was on the social media side of things on the Friday social and digital media um, summit portion which um, was also again another really cool thing or a cool idea whenever posting on Instagram a thought could be that if you want to go and get more followers not just get more followers but get more interaction with your listeners to uh, kind of well challenge them if it's a post that's inspiring or um, encouraging or maybe funny include in there somehow some way hey, you, if this encourages you or makes you think about someone, tag them in it. So it gets the ball rolling so more people not only can follow you, but hopefully and prayerfully with anything that we do in ministry, more people can be encouraged, inspired, come to your station when, as I talked about on that Friday, when they need a little bit of light in the darkness that we live in. This world is a broken, broken place. And if we can be that shining light for someone, that one person who just needs to know that they're cared for and loved, why not? Why not be that for them? And that could be through any digital media, but in particular, Instagram and Twitter. I thought that was a great challenge and a great thought. So those are two things that I learned at the summit. I encourage um, any of you to go to any of these summits and momentum and, and learn and grow. If there are ways for you to learn and grow, grab hold of them. I mean, I've always said, if I'm not learning, I'm dead. <laughs> So um, just that's my thought. Those are my two things that I was able to grab from 2016 Summit in Nashville. And hopefully um, you are inspired and you can take these things with you at your radio station.